All right, we told you about CW here from 6 to 7 on Saturday night. Well, on KDKA at 1135, we have the fourth and final Steelers training camp 2020 show that we'll have for you. A lot of good stuff and analysis on that from Merrill Hodge, Charlie Batch, Rich Walsh, myself, Missy Matthews, Jerry Dulac. It's all 1135 KDKA. I'm going to watch that one, Bob. Oh, I'm going to be all over that one. We've had a lot of good stuff there it. this week, or the last four weeks, actually. So, Logan, I, I can't wait for football to start, and I hope it goes, because quite frankly, Andrew, what else do we got? I mean, the Penguins, I thought, would go for a couple of months, actually. I was hoping that way, and they're Same. not going to go. The Pirates are 4-17. and 17. There's not going to be much else. Who knows about WPIL football? Uh, so we need something. Well, how about the NBA right now, Bob? It is really cooking with these eight seeds, giving one seeds a run for their money. I'm watching yeah. TJ McConnell play for the Pacers. So they're doing a great job in that bubble. I know you're watching late at night. I am, and I'm interested to see. I know that the Orlando was going to lose tonight. I would have bet that one, although I don't know what the point spread was. Because uh, Milwaukee was going to uh, respond, and they did. All right, real quick, let's go out to uh, Tony in the Hill District. Tony, make it quick, please. Hi, Tony. Uh, hello. Um, how you doing? I just want to say, I just want to try to make it real quick. I just want to say, I think the reason why the, pa- the Penguins played so poorly is because I don't think they had the, the practices that they had, like, during the years. And I think, like, not having no fans there cheer for you. All right, and well, Tony, we're out of time. Andrew, real quick, final word to you. Yeah, I don't like that excuse. Other teams are finding a way to win games without fans. Look at the Colorado Avalanche in Vegas. Yeah, they have been unbelievable. They avalanched Arizona for sure. Pony, thanks as always. Appreciate it. See you, Bob. That's going to do it for us, everyone. We'll see you back here tomorrow night, 1035, for another edition of the Sports Call. Good night.